Minister for Intergovernment Relations Kevin Isifu signed on the approval of liquor consumption for Western Highlands Province. Isifu says Western Highlands will now create its own liquor laws when it comes to selling and consumption of liquor in the province. I commend the Western Highlands Provincial Government for passing the law. So now we can go ahead with the signing so that uh, it certifies certify the law so that it can be operated in the provinces, in Western Islands provinces, so they can be able to regulate their own uh, liquor license. Secretary Dixon Guina alluded that liquor laws are important to control the sale and consumption of liquor in the province as it will help also to boost revenue of the province. In 2016, Western Highlands commenced work on their provincial liquor law, but this work was done in consultation with TPLJ. After rigorous wetting the Western Highlands Assembly, chaired by the Honorable Governor Pius Winty, and of which Mr. Honorable uh, Koi Trape is a member, successfully passed the legal licensing law on the 5th of November 2018. Guina says with the laws now passed onto the provinces, the responsibilities are now on the hands of the Western Highlands and its people to carry out the functions of law. He says while social issues are very much associated to liquor, especially in PNG, tougher laws will not only steady the flow of liquor, but also maintain many of the country's social issues that are faced in communities. It is effective now. Local member for Mulbaya, Koi Trape, says black markets will not be tolerated and people will be asked to drink in designated areas, such as clubs and hotels. To the people of Western Highlands, uh, we, you can drink the beer in a proper place, in the hotel or proper, proper club or proper setup, and uh, not in the black market. In the, so we we want to enforce this, and uh, that is why you know we are pushing the. Uh, to become a Godwin Eki, National MTV News.